So the other day I uploaded a video on a custom created grenade mod, which was purposely built to farm bosses with those immune stages, as this grenade itself ignored said immune stages. And well people, it's just got a lot better, because today I introduce to you this grenade's older brother, and it's a wild custom made SMG. How's it going guys, my name is DPJ and if you enjoy your stay here and would like to show your support you can by hitting that like button, also subscribe if you do want to see more. So this weapon also ignores immune stages on bosses, meaning you can farm the likes of Tyrene and Troy, or the Rampager, or any other boss in the game with immune stages and kill them in literal seconds, making that farm way more efficient. Now people, if you want to get your hands on this weapon, drop a like on this video and leave a comment down below with your gamer tag and platform you play on. I will send 5 of you guys on each platform this weapon, but what I do ask is, if you do get this weapon sent to you by me, if you wouldn't mind sharing it about other people on this video, that would be great. Now also this weapon was created by the one and only as a rock, who creates some amazing items for sure. Who also, people, runs an amazing Facebook group based on Borderlands items and giveaways. The link to his Facebook can be found within that video description if you do want to check it out. So this weapon in reality is just so much better than that grenade, especially for me as I don't really use grenades much on Zane, as I like using those two action skills. So having the benefits of that grenade within this SMG is incredible. So how this works is basically as follows. The weapon's second firing mode literally just drains that enemy's health while they are immune. And I was told this is because certain Malia 1 weapons can do this. This one in particular has been infused with the flipper, which also I heard ignores immune stages, but obviously not to this degree. Now when I was first sent this weapon, it was beyond overpowered. I mean to a literal point where it would one hit anything in the game, and I just really didn't enjoy it. I like modded items, but I just don't like them where they're utterly broke. This one I had remade and scaled down massively, so it isn't as powerful as it once was. And although it does still kind of look OP, this is largely because of the build I'm using here, which is incredible, and it can make most weapons seem pretty powerful for sure. Now looking at this monstrosity, it's actually hilarious how big this thing is. And while using it as an everyday weapon, I'm pretty sure you get fed up of only being able to see 25% of your screen. But to have it within your bank for those special occasions when you want to farm certain bosses, that's what I believe this will be good for. Now also with this weapon, I will be doing open loot lobbies on Xbox and PlayStation if you do miss out on me giving them away on this video, which you can find more about on my Discord and linked within that video description. So come and join one of the best BRFD communities out there guys, I guarantee you won't be disappointed. But yeah people, this has been a showcase of this incredible SMG made to ignore immune stages on bosses. And on that note, we have come to the end. If you guys enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more BR3, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video or upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.